The lads have fitted the port side of the tailplane and now move on to the starboard side. A good job has been done restoring the Canadian built rear fuselage allowing the fitting of the port side tailplane to go ahead without major problems. Now for the starboard side. Hey, you ready out? Wants to go up. Yeah. yeah. Right. Tip in front. You ready? Yeah. We need someone around to help him. Ideally. <laughs> it's just, it's just moved off the chop slightly. So we lift the leading edge up. Can you go the normal? Uh, Tiny bit more. Tiny bit more. Right. That's good. Right. right, that's wants to come in. I think when it's not high enough. Don't go up a bit there, Phil. Bring up. Say when. It's just hitting the thing underneath at the moment. Just caught on the. Go a bit higher. That's better. All right, see if it will slide in at that. This one's in this right, side. We need the tip needs to come forward. Yeah. Tip forward. Yeah. yeah. Hang on a minute. Forward. Hang on a minute. Not, not Stop. Stop. Before we go any further, we're going to have a nightmare. This thing here. Well, don't go in. Don't go in. Stop. That's this screw here is not going to go in. I don't know why that's there. Is it for the arm? Oh, for the bloody for the wall plate? Is it? That shouldn't be there because they're all supposed to be, they're all supposed to cancel something around here. Uh, I get a screw on it. I've got a feeling it's got a nut on the other end. That's not going to go. Where are you? What's on the back of it, Dave? Hey, is there see, that, see that hole there? We th there's a hole yeah. there. We think it's sticking out. Yeah. It's a bit lower than that, and, and then involved. Just above the spark. I'm spinning it now. There's an anchor on there, isn't it? For a flat blade screwdriver. Tip forward. Tip forward, please. 
That's it, in at that. Keep going in, keep going in. In. Go straight up now, Norm, if you can. Yeah. Go up now. Yeah, you need to go up there. Yeah. If you can. That was a good noise. <laughs> <laughs> good effort. Go on, go on. Keep going up. No, no, keep going up. Take it back out again though. Far away, isn't you it? You have to touch more, Norm. Touch more. Right, stop. It needs to come inboard or. Uh, yeah, inboard, yeah. Inboard, yeah, try inboard, but we might have to drop the razor on the other side because the port tailplane is holding the starboard one off. Yeah. Try and go inboard with it if you can. Remember, it just wants to. It wants the tip to come rearwards. It can't the because it, it can't because of the other tail plane bobbing up against it. We need to drop the other one slightly yeah. so it's not so holding off. I'm on the other one, ready to drop. Right, this is the word. Just uh, right. very gently, just release it slightly. So I'm ready on port. <laughs> right, oh, crack on. Put it down. Steady. Keep going. Hold it there. Yeah. Right. <coughs> Can you put it? Yeah, tip rear. Yeah, tip rear. Yeah, not much. That, that's close. Not very close, but not. But you're still, you're still about a, like an eighth of a hold out. I can see it. This um, I can see it. It's just, it wants to, just a little bit further rear. Yeah. Yeah. Right, up, uh, well, up, well, if you, can you lift it up up there, Norm? Just get your back under it and lift. There you go. Two foot there. Right, oh, no, that's a tiny, tiny bit more.
Stop. And then what may have to do, we perhaps just need to... Uh, we need to go down. Well, that needs to walk. Go down a bit on the port. Coming down on the port. No, scratch that. Up on starboard. Is it? I'm not saying is it when I'm making it. You knew it. Yeah. Not on this one. Not on this one. Top, yeah. I think, is that the top one? Yeah, put the right one in. Yeah, FT. <laughs> okay. Can't get the socket on, it's a bit too tiny. Oh, there be. Got some nice low quality here as well. Nice one. Right. Nice low quality too. I saw some once, I think we got away with it. <laughs> Intending this year to have many calibrated leaks that will lubricate them. Right. How big should this gap be, Joe, between the tail planes? Minimal. Do you want to go in, Neville? Do you want to go in? No, you go on. No, no, no. no I'm, I'm not here. Sorry. I'm fine, boy. Two centre section, yeah, that's okay. Two fins, two rudders and two elevators to be fitted, followed by the rear turret. John and Keith have done a good job riveting the skins onto the top side of NX664, the French wing. Keith has now skin pinned the last top side skin. This is number two fuel tank bay. Number one fuel tank bay.
as it was in November 2021. Keith and John have put a lot of man hours to reach this stage. 